everybody. So I have my post review. Yay! So excited. So let's get started. Ready? Ready for the shine? Okay, ready? I'll be quiet. Isn't that nice? So we have Diamond Dot Square, Dolphin Sunset, Diamond Dot Square. This is my first pour glue square, my first square from them, my first full pour glue square from them. So they have eight designs. They're available at Joann's. Not sponsored, but I take it if they would. I love it. It's beautiful. I mean, the detail in this kit is just amazing. The shine, the shimmer, everything looks wonderful. Um, I use one of their little wax things for trash. So I will be comparing when I'm done with my paint with diamonds to show you the difference between a poured glue company and a, um, Double-sided adhesive, how much trash. Really, it's not a lot. Um, they're probably mostly bits in the little long pieces, the extra pieces of resin. Not a big deal. Not much. Um, the only thing that's different with a regular Diamond Zots kit versus their square is the color of the drill tray. Everything else is the same. Go look on my list and you can see my Joann's haul when I open this. So I have extra lots of drills. Yeah. I have all of them. Plenty. Let me just pull out the AB to show you up close quality and I'm going to keep the drills and I'm going to keep them separate because I'm really hoping that they come out with more kits because I'll be looking forward to buying them. What kit would I buy right now that's square that's available at Joanne's? Probably the Italian one and I probably would do it for my mother. So I may pick that up next time I'm at Joanne's. Am I looking forward to more? Oh yes I am. I'm looking forward to them coming out with more. And this tray I don't usually use a little trays. This is like my preferred tray, my star or tray from Amazon. Because I like I don't know what that is. Um, I like the size, but I will tell you. Let me show me some of these over here. They do line up very nice in this tray. So I don't know if they designed this tray a little different than their gray tray for the size, but they do line up nice if this is all you're going to use. I didn't have any issues when I did use it because I did want to use it and try it. Um, I do prefer my bigger tray because I find that I shake a little too hard. But um, And this is nice because, too, see how, I mean, you can see it because it's AB, but this is nice for colors like this because I'm going to do the comparison so you can tell. So I am, um, I'm tired and when my eyes are tired, it's hard to focus. So I can focus on this and picking up drills much better because it's not light than trying to focus and pick up drills on here. So if you're, if you are going to do anything else and um, keep any, or rephrase it. If you're going to keep anything else from this kit and that you like, this would be the thing to keep. My, I highly suggest that if you're going to keep diamond painting, having different size trays and different color trays, white is great for dark ones that are darker are great for the lighter colors because you can see them better and this tray is great and they light up beautifully on that tray so i highly recommend keeping that tray i'm going to keep it i'm going to keep all the drills and i'm going to bag them up and put them in my spares separately in case they come out with more kits and i want to um, eventually do maybe 
a freestyle. So who knows? But I'm going to keep them. I mean, you can see. And this kit was, isn't overpowering with the ABs. So we've got ABs there. We've got some ABs up here along the dolphin. And then some ABs down here near the baby dolphin. So the ABs. Oh, and there's a few down here in the water. Right down here. So the ABs, not overpowering. Didn't run out of any. I didn't even have any issues where ABs were stealing my wax. Um, everything worked great. I didn't use their wax. I do, um, because watching Mrs. Coffee, I do like the blue. So I will say, no, I don't. I use their tray. I don't use the pens because I like the thicker pens. But I don't use their, didn't use their wax. I used the blue wax, which I got also from Star Or when it was on. And I like that. And I, not sure if the pink wax it keeps making it harder to use ABs, but I found with the blue wax it's not as it's not stealing the AB off and it's not um, stealing the wax out of the pen either, like it was with the pink one. So that's the only thing in the kit I didn't use. I mean, I don't use the pen in the squishy, but I do did take the wax out to use it as garbage and I will label this one so I can compare later on when I'm done with the double sided adhesive square one how much trash is in here versus how much trash is in there and I do um definitely recommend the little, the little tray is awesome they have other trays that are gray and their little sticker kits they have the little non-spout trays too so their tray quality is very nice they're um, overall effectiveness of the ABs looks beautiful in this kit. The placement, I mean, there's no gapping, there's no um, extra spaces, there's no issues with anything popping. I mean, I can run my hands over this all day long. There's nothing I'm feeling at all. And I already wiped it off, so... I already ran a wipe on it just to catch any extra wax and it looks great. There's nothing that's catching, so but yes, I recommend diamond dots, I recommend diamond dot squares, I recommend trying them out if you want to try them out and try out squares. I highly recommend there's eight so far that I've seen. Um Michaels and Hobby Lobby. I have looked at Michaels and Hobby Lobby and I've looked on their websites. So far, they're not carrying it. So, so far, it looks like Joanne Fabrics is the only brick and mortar store you can buy them from. I'm not sure. I know I've seen a couple other people buy Diamond Dots through a different store online that offers them. Like, there's, um, is it Diamond Art with Dell, I think? She's in Australia, and she gets them from a different store. So I'm not sure if the squares are available, but I do know that um, if you check out Diamond Art with Dell, um, there's a store that she's mentioned that she gets Diamond Dots from, but it's not. That's an online store, and it's not an actual physical store. So, so far, Joann's is the only place in the States that I've seen that has these. And you can get them on Joann's website or app, and you can get them in the store. So I probably, the next time I go there, will probably be bringing home the Italian one that looks like it's supposed to be seen from Venice. So yeah, I definitely enjoyed it. It was the most enjoyable square I worked on. And I will continue to buy Diamond Dots products because I do believe they have a very good quality. I like using discounts and coupons and catching things on sale, catching things on um, clearance and being able to physically pick it up and buy it is nice versus the anticipation of waiting for it to be delivered. But either way, if you get it from Joanne's online or you get it in the store, it's the same quality because it's the same exact kit. So yeah. So 
thank you. I'm glad that I was, did this. I'm glad to be able to share this because I haven't seen anybody finish the dolphin. Um, G, G Malt, Grace um, with G Maltese, I believe, did the deer. So check her out if you want to check out what the deer look like when it's done. And then oh, somebody did the wolf. I don't remember. I don't know if it was wolf pack or... I don't remember now. But anyway, I will put down in the description the names of people I've seen finish them. If you want to see the finished product for Diamond Dot Square, I've seen the wolf finished, I've seen the deer finished, and there was one other one. The wolf, the deer. Uh, I'll have to go back and look back on YouTube, but I wanted to be able to have the dolphin up, so if anybody dog here, wanted to see the dolphin finish, see how it looked, that it was would be available for somebody to look at. So, Norman Diamond Painting is a hobby. It is a craft for fun. I enjoy doing it. It makes me a happier person. It makes me a better mother, a happier wife and a more calmer person. So bye, everybody.